Hey guys, so today I'm going to be teaching you how to make um, one of my favourite dishes which is sea bass, grilled sea bass. It's going to be the whole sea bass and it's so good, it's healthy, it's nutritious and it's so easy to make. You can make it within, what, 20 minutes? Um, I'll be doing a step-by-step -step video. I hope you like it. Leave your comments below, make sure you subscribe and I'll see you later. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Alexis Oladipo. So first, we're going to cut our garlic. So the easiest way to do this is just to get the knife, place it on top of the garlic um, clove and press down firmly and then you'll see that the skin just, just starts to come away with ease. A dish without garlic is basically not a dish in my opinion and if you don't like garlic are you sure you're not a vampire <laughs> moving on to our ginger we're actually going to grate our ginger it just helps manage it a bit better and it gets all the flavors going so let's grate add your herbs the garlic, your ginger, the dried mixed herbs, salt, which is pink Himalayan salt, chili powder, and black pepper. So what you want to do now is add a few drops of olive oil into your seasoning and mix until you get a thick consistency, like a thick paste. So once your seasoning is to its tasting, grab your knife and make sure you carefully score the fish down the sides. Repeat the process on the other side and it just helps allow the seasoning to get into the fish penetrating with more flavours. And then you just take your mix and then brush it all over. So at this point guys you don't want to hold back on the seasoning, make sure you get inside that fish, around that fish, on the side of that fish is make sure it's all covered and literally soaked in the seasoning. And then your fish should look a little something like this. Ready, fully marinated to go into the grill. There's just one last thing that we need to do. Lemons. So once you've got your lemon guys, make sure you slice them and then slice them into halves again so you can put them into the fish. And you place them in between where you scored the fish earlier so the juices can flow. Give it a little squeeze. I love adding lemons to my sea bass. They make them taste so good, especially afterwards. Just adds that extra, I don't know, rubber bomb. And there you have it. So our sea bass is ready to go into the grill. This will grill for about 10 minutes on each side. So make sure it's thoroughly cooked for 10 minutes on each side and then you should be ready to eat it. So there you have it guys, my delicious grilled sea bass recipe. I've decided to have it with some plantain um, with a side of lemon just to drizzle some flavour over the top and you know make them juices flow. Um, this is like one of my favourite things to make. It's so easy, it's quick, it's healthy, you know we're all trying to get all snatched and whatnot so 
This is a perfect meal and you can make it in under 20 minutes. That's the beauty of it. So I hope you guys really enjoyed watching me. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you want me to make anything else. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And yeah, you know, thumbs up, give us a like, and I hope to see you back soon. Thank you, bye. That's done, you take your, what is this called? Again, um, pestilent something. I don't know what this is called, but your yeah. crushy thing. Your crush thing. Okay.